Hey, it's Marty from Aspect LED. Today we're going to talk about the wireless RGBW multi-zone LED wall controller, how to sync it to the Z-Series receiver, and what the buttons do. If you think this video is helpful, please like and subscribe. The first thing we want to do is clear out the memory on the Z-Series receiver. And to do that, you press and hold the learning key until the strip lights flash. When they flash, we know we've cleaned out the memory on the Z-Series receiver. Okay, on the remote, or the wall controller, first of all, you want to make sure that it's on. When you press this power button right here, this red light will turn blue. Blue means it's on, red means it's off. So we're going to start with it on. First thing we have to do is pair the wall controller to the receiver. And to do that, we're going to assign the receiver zone 1. So we press zone 1 the learn button and the color wheel. It'll flash and now we're controlling the color chip. The white LED chip is also on. If you'd like to turn that off to see what you're doing easier, press this button twice. So now we can talk about the color wheel and the color LED chip. You can choose any color you want along the color wheel or you can choose red, green, or blue by pressing one of these buttons. If you press one of these primary buttons and then you press another primary button, it's going to blend the two. So this is red plus green, so kind of an off yellow. If you'd like to go straight green, turn off the red. Now I'm going to turn off the green and go to blue. I want to make blue and red, which makes magenta, mix them together. Now I want to turn off the blue press that again and we go straight to red. If you want to control just the white LEDs on the chip, use this button. Pressing the button just turns the light on and off. If you hold the button it controls the brightness. Brought it all the way down to the lowest setting and bring it back up to the brightest setting and turn it off. Now I'm going to talk about controlling the color brightness. You can control it with the sun button. If you press and hold it, it'll dim the lights down. Press and hold it again. It'll bring them back up to full bright. You can also do RGB created white by pressing this button in the middle. There are three different color options. A warm white, a medium white, and a cool white. If you want to have a really bright strip, you can go to warm white and the white chips dedicated to have the, all of the LEDs illuminated white. You can also play different uh, programs with this by pressing this button. This will show different color sequences. There are 10 pre-programmed into this controller. To advance from one to the next, you press this button twice. If you press the button once, it will pause on whatever color it is on. There are lots of options. Finally, as we began, there are three zone buttons. So if you had more than one Z-Series receiver and wanted to control different zones, you could program zone 2 to another receiver and zone 3 to another receiver. If you find this video helpful, please like and subscribe.